this i'll start the video off with this this is my like i said what's my plan of action this is my hair when it's wet this is well i can't say wet it's like really dampened i put water on it um like i said the texture has changed it has changed that's why i said from root to tip now i'm wavy I can show a picture, I could, hear me out, could show a picture that literally, <gasps> my bang was here, here, what's my bang now, here, is this a bang, I don't even know what that's a bang, It, 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 it waves up now but we're now going to go and talk about what what is the plan of action so yeah I just want you to see it truly up close of what it looks like now with the different texture oh I have to I didn't have to fan off for the last minute and some change I'm sorry I forgot the fan was on so yes it's a bit airy in here I apologize but yeah that's how it looks now so yeah if I get my hair wet totally and I started to see this before if I get, you know, go and take a shower, this is what I saw. Like, because I always don't wear a shower cap or if I wash my hair. If I'm sham if I'm shampooing condition, I don't care what gets in it. This is what happens. Product, no product. This is me now. And it was like, what happened? Did some research. That's what um, I come to find out. I've never had hair. This short. Next step. Stay tuned. I'll be back literally in a fraction of a second. Literally. I told y'all I was coming back. And I'll turn the fan off this time because I turned the air on. I told y'all I was coming back. You thought I was going to come back? I told y'all I was. This is going to be one way that I make it through this process. Yes. This is going to make sure I'm covering the tag. This is an affinity scarf. I've been doing my, like I said before, my music soul child. Um, Angie Stone type situation. I'm a neo soul girl all day. I wear a fro with no problem. The thing about it is my own hair. It doesn't do well for me. I used to wear, I'll get this corn rolled and then get the rest sewed in. I'll have a fro. Oh my goodness. I used to love those days. My, my middle sister still does it. Um, but she's natural. So she does it because she doesn't, you know, put anything else in her hair. But for me, the my hair texture didn't do well with... She does her own hair like that at times. Slint. She does her own hair like that at times. And then, of course, she do a sew-in. And I don't know if I'm ready for a sew-in yet because I haven't had one in literally... It will be 10 years next year. So I don't know if I'm ready for braids, but wigs and... Wigs and... And... and um, yeah, I say wigs. Yeah. Wigs. I don't know if I'm ready for the braids, but wigs will be one of my things. I'm thinking about the crochet braids. We'll see. Hey, I may do faux locks one day until this stuff grows back. But this is going to be one thing. Yes, it's protective. I'm not touching nothing. You don't see my hair. What I do do, I do put up um, underneath it. I don't like to use this one because you'll see through it. But I will use a satin um, scarf underneath it just so the cotton will not be connected like straight to my head but that's how I do I do separate the two I love this this is very easy like I said this is an infinity scarf I've used a dress before um, I found this at Ross I think for like maybe ten dollars I think it was like ten dollars good and less um yeah I use a dress like I bought a dress from Walmart before I didn't care for it and I was like, this got a nice feel to it, but it was short sleeve. So I had to make sure that I kept it. I can do wonders with some fabric. <laughs> Just know that. But yes, this is one way I will be, you know, keeping my hair away from me. So I won't have to see it or won't feel like, woe is me. Oh. You know, that's one. This is one way. And like I said, any other kind of hair attachments. I never try to clip in, but I really don't want to touch my hair. I want my hair to be just to lie dormant right now as it you know redo itself and I know it will I have true faith with it my hair grow 
as, as we have all seen. It can grow. It's just that I have to make sure the inside is good so it can come out. So, you guys already know about the good old biotin that I am on. Remember this one, the keratin I gave you guys a disclaimer. Please watch that video. I think it says um, disc biotin disclaimer. Shout out to Alex. Um, a sub, one of the people I follow, I'm subbed her channel, and she was showing her biotin and made me remember that I didn't say it on my video that I should not, shouldn't even close my video out without telling you about the MCGs and the Jeeves and who talked to and milligrams and you know, those things. Yeah, go watch that vid. Um, and of course, I gotta stay on this because of um, my monthly. Uh, this is a kind of like a disclaimer. If you're a dude, you probably want to like close, like just stop. I know I only got 24% of you guys, but just stop right here because it may just be a little bit too much for y'all. Just stop. Okay. You not? You got, they gone? Okay, ladies. Yeah, I do the iron because I do have, you know, the whole iron issue. I have a heavy, 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 heavy cycle. Well, the cycle could be heavy, heavy, heavy because of the thyroid. This, this, this little, this little butterfly situation that's in here somewhere. Like, it's right here, actually. I know where it's at. It's right here. It caused a lot of things. The whole pituitary glands and adrenal gland. That, I mean, you if you don't keep them 100, you would you could be just shot to hell because it just won't work well. But since I do heavy clotting and heavy bleeding, I have to take iron pills. The iron pills is not absorbing, but guess what? I can't worry about it. I'm just going to keep taking it and eating the spinach and hoping something comes out. As I put on Instagram, I said I, I am tired. I am no longer going to allow a physician to tell me no. I am now my physician. I am who? Dr. Y.R. Collins. That's just it. I'm tired. I'm not going to keep fighting with you to get better. What? Excuse me? This is my health, my body, and I don't have time for you to play guinea pig with me. Been there, done that. Trust me. I trust me. That literally I was in a hospital laid up. I'm like, what you give me is burning. Oh, we gave you the wrong stuff. The f and I was in my teens back then when they messed up. So, no, I've been through enough with that. I work in the industry. I see they mess up all day and blame somebody else. So, no, no, no. I told you I was going to find something, and I did. Yes. This is Emerald Laboratories Thyroid Health. A raw whole food-based formula with probiotics and enzymes. Now, a lot of people frown upon dietary supplements. I understand. I hear ya. But when you've had 15 million doctors, all don't know what to do. You have to stand on your own and say, today is the day I'm going to fix it. I don't care. I, hey, y'all already put me through, you know, up and down, round and round, leaps and bounds. And you guys put me through. I might as well just do my own research. And that's what I do. If they want to play with me, hell, let me play with me too. So that's what I do. I've told my doctors, stop. Don't worry, I have it. So when I found this, I went to, I don't even know if I did a haul on this. How High, um, the name of the store is How High. They're on the website, on the internet, if you choose to look them up. And this is just a supplement. Now, anytime you do a dietary supplement, it's not, you know, covered by the um, CDC. So, of course, many licensed professionals will kind of frown upon it. This is more of a holistic way because it's natural. Doctors want to give you stuff from the CDC so the pharmacy can get their money. And I'm not even going to go through all that. Just know they really frown upon it because no real testing has um, been, um, you know, looked over. It It hasn't been signed off. Nevertheless, it gives me the T3 that most, you know, the the, high, the thyroid would need or T4. And it has those things. And I have to take two a day. I started it Friday. Um, you have to take it on empty stomach. I was like, no. But what I do do, I take it with... Um, since, oh, since, remember, I'm not doing, like, real sweets, I take it with my Slim Fast, and it works. Um, I don't have to get sick. Like I said, the real sweet thing, diabetic type 2, I'm not trying to go through the whole foot ulcers, thrush. I know some people call it thrush. It's like thrush, you know, it's thrush. Yeah, thrush. Yeah. In the best in the mouth. I'm not trying to go through all that again. So, I don't do the sweets. I didn't even eat sweets on my mom's birthday. I know. I didn't know. I didn't touch nothing. They had ice cream too. Didn't touch it. But this is the pill. Um, thyroid health. It now. I ain't gonna lie. This is real big. And you know, natural meds or natural vitamins, dietary supplements. Think. This did too. 
You have to take two of these on an empty stomach. I don't take nothing on an empty stomach. I took biotin on an empty stomach one time, and I thought life was as I knew it was over. I was like, huh, what's wrong with my stomach? Oh, <laughs> that was like in my beginning times. My friend was like, you dummy, you only got money, but you told me. And she said, it said take with the meal. I was like, oh. So I don't do it no more. I learned my lesson. So I take two of these in the morning. I literally got up at 5.30 this morning, almost 6 a.m. I took my meds. I took my supplements. I said, nah, we're going to see what happened. You're not going to be playing with me. This is $35. The store had a very good policy. If you take it and something is wrong, meaning that your, your body doesn't like it, or you start getting you know, nauseous, any kind of um, bad advert reaction, you bring it back to them, they give you your money back. And they have a, like, buy one, get one half off. And that's what I did with these. You guys know what? Love my now solution stuff. And this is now for what? Vegetable glycerin. And this is the now for what? The sweet almond oil. And I still use these. I'm not going to stop. Just because I got my hair cut off don't mean I'm going to stop moisturizing my hair. Now, am I in a full HHJ? No, I'm not doing a full healthy hair journey. I'm doing a healthy body journey. HBJ. I want my body to be healthy, not just the hair. Okay, so yes, I'm still doing that. Yes, I still use my moisturizer. Yes, I still use my uh, filtered water. Yes, yes, and yes. So how am I going to combat this? Someone would say, Yolanda, that is too much. And I do do a multi here and there if I can remember to take my Flintstone. Allow me to give you the heads up. Since I do have a um, vitamin deficiency. Nothing is really too much for me. However, I am so aware if this is the newbie and I've been doing these and I'm taking all three and something starts happening, you just pull it back from things. I'm not going to pull back from this first. I'm going to pull back from these because I know these work. These may not like to work with that. So I'm going to pull away. If I saw that I was taking, I'm taking that and now this and something's happening, I'm going to pull it back and not take my biotin. Stick with this because this is what I need and I'm pull away. If I start seeing like, okay, I'm taking this, this, but something's starting happening, I'm going to pull away. Now, I'll be honest. Nothing in here says biotin. Nothing. Nothing in here says iron. Nothing. That's more of a multivitamin. I'm actually taking this for my thyroid only. Now, it will be great if my thyroid starts to act right and the levels go up. And I start to see that I don't need my iron pill. I can see that my nails are growing again. I stopped taking it. <gasps> That'll be great because for every one iron pill I take, that's why I told my men to hang, get off my line, don't watch the vid. For every one of these, I got to take about seven of these. I am not going to lie to you guys. I'm not a, I'm not a G when it comes down to taking this. I'm no gangster with this. If I take one of these, I got to take about seven of these. If not, you can mess around and get hemorrhoids. I'm just giving y'all a heads up. So, yes, it's things I'm going to do, and I'm going to do it with a smile. And no, I may not do it with you guys every day. No, you may not hear an update every second. No, you may get a video from me, and I'm not showing my face. I'm okay with that, and I hope you guys are too, because y'all know how I look. Yeah, it's all the same. It's just that, I mean, if I'm giving you a HK haul, you may not need to see my face. You just need to see the product. But, yes, that's how I'm going to combat it. Wigs, weaves, braids. I don't know, flat twists, twist stouts, washing goals, all of the dietary supplements I just showed you, my vitamins, the lovely oils and vegetable glycerin, some water, shampoo, conditioner, however, it, oh, and I'm going to get my intro every eight weeks. That's about it. And guess what? I'm still going to do it what? With a smile. <laughs> it's not easy. Trust, I got to push myself to smile because with your thyroids, it messes with your mood. Hormones mess with that. So I'm just going to push myself and I'm going to continue to push myself. And I'm not giving up on me. I would never give up on me. And I hope and pray you would never give up on you. You are your biggest cheerleader. Don't give up on you. And I'm not going to give up on me. So thank you for watching. Please stay along for the entire journey of the Missy O Show. And any updates, I will show you guys. And stay tuned. I'm sure something else will be um, popping up here and there. Thank you. And I love you guys. Bye.